Hello! In this video I build my first 3D printer from do-it-yourself kit Tiva Tarantula and I will print 4 battery holders for my cordless power tools batteries. I got Tiva Tarantula 3D printer DIY kit and it is my first ever 3D printer. The packaging was excellent and the parts were all in labeled bags. I also supplied two rolls of PLA filament. The instructions was a bit helpful, but it is worth to watch full assembly video guide on YouTube. Assembly was fairly straightforward. First assembled smaller parts and after that put all together in one final piece. Often I have issues in different projects when I need to make some specific size and shape parts, especially when they are quite small. To make them from wood, plastic or other materials often is too tricky to do. So, 3D printer will solve this issue like a dream. Why I choosing this one 3D printer? I was looking at the best price and printing quality offer in the market for around 200 euros. After spent some time online watching 3D printers reviews, I found that for my budget and needs, Tivo Tarantula 3D printer will be the perfect choice. Plus, it is DIY kit, what saves you extra money and give a lot of pleasure to build it by yourself. This printer came from gearbest.com and I leave a link in video description if you want to get them too. After playing around with wires regarding provided diagram, 3D printer looks like this. Let's power it up, preheat extruder, insert PLA filament and printer is ready to print. This printer isn't perfect straight from the box. But with few small modifications, it will get a really good machine regarding its price. There are a lot of videos online how to upgrade it to get perfect printing quality. At the moment what I did, I uh, leveled a bed, calibrated stepper motors and added a cooling fan duct. I was surprised how cooling improved printing quality. I leave links in video description to stepper's calibration guide and a steel cooler file, which could be downloaded from Thingiverse.com. From Thingiverse.com downloaded already model battery holder for my Bosch batteries. Slice it with Simplify 3D, export it to SD card and started printing. I didn't want to go step by step which and why setting was chosen, because this probably take a half an hour of talk. I used filament which came in printer package, so don't judge me for that color. If you want to print something and don't have a model file, STL file, the first step which you should do is to check Thingiverse.com. Maybe there are already designed and needed part. It is a great source of all kind of models. After two hours of printing, battery holder was cooked. And I could say that it came out almost perfect. It is awesome result from 3D printer worth of 200 euros. Thumbs up Tivo Tarantula. After another 6 hours of printing, I got all 4 needed holders and what's left to secure them in place. If you are considering to purchase one of these printers, you should be aware that it is DIY kit and needs some time and skill to get it running. If you love DIY stuff like I do, that won't be an issue. Once it is running, you can achieve really good results. Plus, there is heaps of support on the Facebook page which is an excellent source of knowledge. I hope this video was helpful. If you are first time here, please hit that subscribe button for upcoming videos. Thanks for watching.